Hello everybody, Patches84 here, and today is officially Easter 2022, absolutely a relaxing day, uh, weather outside, I mean it's not all that great right now, but it's not necessarily the worst, uh, currently just relaxing in my own home and wearing this nice lovely new top that I got uh, from Rose Gal. It cost me, I would say, close to $30 Canadian uh, for a shirt like this. It took me about a month to get it, but, you know, I got it, and that's all that matters. Um, I am actually going to be visiting my parents this afternoon or later today for Easter dinner. Uh, look forward to that. And I'm actually going to show you guys what their kitchen looks like now. Um, not entirely or completely done. Uh, some work still needs to be done in their kitchen, but you guys will get a first-hand look of what it's what it looks like right now compared to like a few years back or even last year. I remembered um, this time last year when I was cat sitting, we had some old uh, kitchen cabinets and whatnot. Um, I believe it was like all red, which isn't a really good color for a kitchen the size that it is um, but my parents had to replace uh, all the cabinets and even the um, countertop and they put in a new sink uh, we still have this the fridge the oven and dishwasher all that good stuff in the kitchen uh, but other than that it's um, it's actually looking a lot nicer it's looking much more new not certain if they put in the backsplash or not, because they did mention putting in a backsplash uh, in their kitchen. So, definitely looking forward to seeing what the kitchen looks like now. Um, I've seen photos, but I haven't actually seen the whole kitchen in its entirety um, with my own two eyes, like up close and in person. Um, but that is something that I am looking forward to doing now. Um, it is 1.40 p.m. though, and I probably won't be leaving here till anywhere between 3.30 and 4 o'clock. So I'll be at the house at around 4 o'clock tonight, and um, I will definitely show you guys what the kitchen looks like um, once I do get to their house. My iPhone is going to be my main source of the camera while I'm there due to the fact that I will not be bringing my GoPro with me to the house, obviously. But uh, yeah, it's been a rather exciting time. I remember when I was a little kid, I used to always go Easter egg hunting with my brother um, pretty much every year. And we'd always get up in the morning the, the excitement it's like it's like a second Christmas in a way except in the spring and instead of getting actual gifts like say a Barbie doll or whatever you get Easter eggs and other forms of chocolate I do remember one year in particular where I woke up one morning and I found a basket full of a few Easter eggs on top of my dresser by my bed and that and when you think of Easter as a kid, you think of Easter as you're getting Easter eggs, like chocolate Easter eggs and whatnot. And there may be other gifts as well. Um, we don't obviously do that anymore because my brother and I are adults and we're living in our own homes now. So Easter egg hunting is no longer a thing um, for us, but uh, that doesn't mean that we don't celebrate Easter. We just do things in a in a very different way and uh, that's something that I'm obviously excited about is as you get older you don't think of uh, Easter as Easter egg hunting anymore unless of course if you got kids of your own and you're trying to be a little sneaky and you're like I'm gonna put some Easter eggs all throughout the house the night before and then you wake up the next morning and then you're like I wonder what the Easter Bunny left behind. Um, those days are over now uh, for myself and for my brother. But again, 
Uh, that doesn't necessarily mean we don't celebrate it. We still do. We just do it in a different way. And Easter is really about celebrating the, the death and rebirth of Jesus Christ, uh, which is really the whole point to Easter in the first place. It's not always about Easter egg hunting or anything like that, but the reason why they incorporated that into the holiday is for the kids to get all excited and really like build the excitement and be like, ooh, we got some chocolate. But um, Easter is actually much more than that. It's it's really to celebrate the the rebirth of Christ after his crucifixion, and that's basically what Easter is really about. Now, some people are like, ah, I don't care, but there are people out there that that do actually think of it as that, and that's basically what. I was told growing up, it's what my brother was told growing up, it's basically what we were being told by our families as we got older. We didn't understand it back then because we were, we were kids, right? We don't, we don't know everything about what's going on in the world, why we have these holidays in the first place. But those are basically what the holidays are really about. It's simply about actually learning about the birth of Christ, for example, during Christmas, and then, of course, the death and rebirth of Christ during Easter. And I see a bunch of pigeons flying around in the window. But that's basically what I, how I learned about Easter and how I learned about why we have Easter in the first place. And that's basically what it is. Um, but yes, I will be celebrating Easter uh, with the fam, be going to the house. I will be showing you guys what the kitchen looks like if I can. I will be using my iPhone uh, to show you guys since I will not be bringing my GoPro and I won't be filming very much uh, once I'm there because, like I said, there's going to be some changes uh, to my channel. And if you guys haven't noticed in my last video i don't know if i mentioned it or not but yes some of my videos recently had to be removed from my channel um not just because of spring cleaning as a whole but a lot of it has to do with the fact that there had been some issues going on behind the scenes and those videos for whatever reason had played a role and hence I had to clean up my channel a little bit. Um, so yeah, there, there will not be any more of those older vlogs on, on the channel. I've basically removed them for obvious reasons. Uh, some of it was for legal, re legal reasons, I guess you could say. Um, I was threatened with a lawsuit with at least one of the videos and that's why most of them had to be taken down. And yeah, that's not fun. But um, but the videos are no longer up, or some of the videos are no longer up. Uh, some older videos dating as far back as 2008, on the other hand, are still up. Thank goodness for that. Um, but yes, the videos in question, some of, mostly the vlog videos are gone. And you probably won't see them again because I haven't saved them. But... It is what it is. Things happen for a reason, and sometimes you just, you gotta live with them and deal with it. And that's basically it. But um, hopefully in the future, I will be posting more videos um, onto this channel. Maybe something that's a little bit more positive due to the fact that I've had some negative stuff happening over the last few months, but life goes on, eh? But anyway, guys, I want to wish you all a happy Easter. Uh, this video probably will not be out until sometime after due to the fact that a lot of things have been going on. But I will show you guys after this video is done um, what the kitchen at my parents' house looks like now and a few other things that have gone down off and on over the last couple of weeks. And... We'll end the video with those, but until 
hopefully I'll be able to get out more and do more videos and stuff like that. And the reason why is if you look out the window, there's no snow on the ground anymore. You might see, still see a few. But if you look up at the sky, Mother Nature has other plans uh, regarding whether or not I get to go out and get to do the stuff that I set up to do. Um, but uh, hopefully within a day or so, I'll be able to get out, maybe do some outdoor videos perhaps, maybe using my GoPro, maybe not. One will never know. But anyway, guys, um, I hope you guys have a great Easter. Uh, before I do end the video completely, I want to say thank you all uh, for sticking by me um, for everything uh, thick and thin and hopefully I'll do more videos in the future uh, with that this is Patches84 signing off I will see you guys in the next video but before I do leave YouTube for the Easter season or for the time being I want to show you guys a couple of clips uh, a few clips actually and then we'll end this video completely and hopefully hopefully more videos to come after this maybe i'll do some more outdoorsy video using my gopro who knows this is patches 84 signing off i will see you guys in the next video happy easter have a happy safe easter stay healthy out there because we are still in the midst of a pandemic peace so this is a wider cabinet so i can put more of the stuff in here without having to fight with it you know what it was like and uh, you can take a look around. Look at the size of the pantry. Right. That thing's bigger than a. Whoa! Lots of space. Dude! Yeah, all the snacks are top. Keep trying to give me a Check in this drawer here in the cupboard there, okay? So this comes out. This comes out, and it's quite close. Oh, when you slide, careful! You close those. Bang your head again. And the same over there in that cupboard, but next to the dishwasher. And just check under the sink. It's the ceiling. It's the overflowing. Yeah, see the garbage coming there. Open up the other side. While you're cleaning stuff. Watch this. Ooh. This is cool because this comes out, and then it comes up. Now that I got all the stuff in it. So I can take that to the house with me. When I'm done, I just bring it back in here. I don't find the wheels. I can't see them right now. So no peninsula in the kitchen anymore, eh? Nope. Just got to put new tiles down. Got a couple new shelves there. I'm going to put white ones here instead. The oh, that, explain, the that explains why the shelves that were there before were taken out. Yeah. I just noticed that. And we showed you the tile that we have? Yeah, the back splash. Some green beans. Okay. Did you hear how Penn Jillette lost weight? Went on a diet of nothing but potatoes. Lost like 200 pounds. I don't know. Oh, well, well. First time back here since the fall of last year and look at all these darn trees. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I want to thank you all for watching. If you guys want to see more videos like this one, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And also, do not forget to hit the notification bell. This is Patches84 signing off. I will see you guys next time.